In an emergency, the airport firefighting services must be able to get to any location on the airport grounds and start putting out the blaze within three minutes. To do this, we need particularly fast vehicles. A whole fleet of special vehicles is on call. Everything from ambulances and equipment vehicles for hazardous goods to the Panther, which was developed especially for fighting aircraft fires. It's one of the most high-performance fire engines in the world. A real powerhouse, as you can see and hear. A special highlight of this vehicle is the extinguishing boom, which enables us to put out aircraft fires from above, below and all sides. And there's a piercing tool which allows us to puncture the shell of the fuselage if we can't get inside. During routine drills, the Panther proves just how fit it is. This goes for model FE410A2. It's the all-rounder among the fire vehicles. Its official designation, auxiliary fire tender. This vehicle is manned with seven firefighters, the driver and a crew of six, that's two squads. It's used to fight fires and provide technical support. The Panther built by Rosenbauer only requires a two-man crew. The engine driver brings the vehicle from the firehouse to the incident scene and the co-driver is responsible for operating the entire extinguishing technology. He's in charge of executing the whole firefighting operation. The 20-meter-long extinguishing boom is controlled using a joystick. You need special training to operate the vehicle and a driver's license for the airport. Needless to say, aircraft have right of way here. After a successful drill, the crew returns to the firehouse. The last challenge of the day, parking. 